you're about to discover how to get more subs and views on your YouTube videos by adding closed captions. Adding captions to your videos will help you boost SEO results on both YouTube and Google and also provide accessibility for the hearing impaired. Let's create these captions inside the Camtasia editor and then upload them with our video to YouTube. And we're going to do that right now. Hey, it's Gord here. Welcome. If it's your first time here and it's your passion to make great videos, become a ninja at video editing and learn more tips on how to succeed with video and marketing on YouTube, then make sure you hit the subscribe button and click the bell notification icon so you don't miss a thing. Let's dive in. With the Camtasia caption tool, you can add captions manually, import an existing caption type file, copy and paste in a narration script from another file and then use the sync captions option or even auto generate a script through the speech to text option. Of course, depending on the option you choose, you will have additional tasks to perform in order to achieve a polished result. Since our need is to produce a video with closed captions to upload to a video hosting service like YouTube or Vimeo, you will need to produce an exported.srt caption file to accompany your mp4 video file for upload, or render and upload your video to YouTube through Camtasia's Share to YouTube feature, whereby you can upload captions as part of the process without having to create the .srt export file. The .srt is known as a subrip file that can be used to display captions over various files like AVIs and mp4s. The caption files not only include the subtitles and caption text, but they also include the timing and other details. You can actually look at the .srt file by changing its file type to .txt and looking at it in Notepad. You can even do edits in Notepad if you desire. Now let's look at a few scenarios for caption creation. Scenario 1. You have no script of any kind. In essence, you're starting from scratch. The simplest solution is to add the caption text on the fly as you play the video. Simply press the Add Caption button to add each piece through the caption editor as you go, with each successive caption being added after the last one ended. Another option is to have Camtasia auto-generate captions through the Speech-to-Text script option. Once the captions have been auto-generated, you will want to put in all the punctuation and fix the speech-to-text transcription errors. The speech-to-text feature in Camtasia is based on the Windows speech-to-text engine that learns based on the training that you've done. The accuracy of the text produced often leaves a lot to be desired, and so, based on the results produced, you will need to decide if this approach works for you. Also, if there are multiple voices, music or sound effects, the produced script may not be very usable. Camtasia creates a caption clip track with clip segments. Each caption clip segment has up to three lines of text maximum. The words per caption can be updated by running the Sync Captions option in the Script Options menu, but before you run that, it's best to fix all the punctuation and transcription errors so that you will have better precision in the syncing effort. Hey, it's Gord Eisman here from Richmond Hill in Ontario, Canada. I'm 57 years young and I recently reinvented myself as a YouTuber, showing people and businesses how to grow through the use of video. I've been a huge Jack Canfield fan since the initial release of the Success Principles book. In February 2015, I met Jack at his Breakthrough to Success event in Las Vegas. After my successful IT career came to an abrupt end, my self I will forever be humbled by Jack Canfield as an exemplary, divine, giving person and awesome transformational leader. Thank you, Jack. Hey, it's Gord Eisman here from Richmond Hill in Ontario, Canada. I'm 57 years young and I recently reinvented myself as a YouTuber, showing people and businesses how to grow through the use of video. If you are producing videos for government clients or for hearing impaired accessibility, then following government compliance rules and the ADA, 
Americans with Disabilities Act, Standards for Your Script Creation is a Good Idea. By default, Camtasia features ADA-compliant formatting, but you can override it if you desire. Scenario 2 for Caption Creation you have a video narration script from another source, for example a Word file or from another speech-to-text tool like Dragon Naturally Speaking. For this solution, you can paste the text into the caption editor and then synchronize it. Of course, as with the copy and paste method above, you will need to review and edit the result to your satisfaction. Once you've completed your captioning, you then need to use the script option Export Script to create the caption.srt export file to upload along with your rendered video file into YouTube. Again, as mentioned above, you can use the Share YouTube Production Wizard that will support auto-inclusion of the caption data along with your video in the upload. Closed captioning for YouTube. This can be achieved in two ways. Method one, using YouTube Video Manager for uploading. In Camtasia, Create a caption export.srt file for use along with your mp4 file for uploading into YouTube. Be sure that the captions track is visible, that is not hidden, so that the .srt file is created with the captions. Step 2. In Camtasia, create the mp4 file for upload, but be sure that the captions track is now hidden. By hiding the captions track, you ensure that the mp4 output produced has no captions burned into it. Step 3. Upload the mp4 file to YouTube as you normally would, and then follow it up with the upload of your captions.srt file. To load the .srt file, use the subtitles slash cc facility and select your srt file for upload. The result will be a proper video with closed captioning working. Method 2. Using the Camtasia Share YouTube Production Wizard. Step 1. First, be sure to leave the captions track visible in Camtasia. Step 2. As per the wizard's request, log into your Google account so that the utility can execute the upload to YouTube. Step 3. Fill in the production wizard details you wish for the video metadata and be sure that you check the Upload Captions option so that the captions will get loaded. Selecting this option will result in the captions being loaded. No separate .srt file creation and upload is required. The result will be a proper video with closed captioning working. Please also note that if you're working from scratch with no narration script, you could use the similar subtitle caption creating features that already exist inside YouTube. YouTube has its own auto-generating speech-to-text feature and synchronization and caption updating. You can even request professional paid transcription services from within YouTube as part of your process to set up the subtitle slash closed captioning in the video manager. Outside of YouTube professional services, another third-party source for transcribing captioning and translating is Rev.com. This route is especially useful if you're planning to produce multiple language subtitles or captioning for your upload. Wow! Adding captions to your videos to help increase views and subs is a great growth strategy for your channel. If you want more cool tips for video creating and you wish to create better videos from home, click on the link for my free ebook. And if you don't already subscribe to my channel, please do so. Be sure to hit the subscribe icon on this page so that you get more videos like this in the future. And thanks so much for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.